was at the wrong place at the right time Cause suddenly there you were with those bright blue eyes We were conversing at the Hey guys, good morning. Today is Friday and we are still here. <laughs> so today I actually have things to do, like I have plans what I want to do today but I want to go and like book them. Like you can't just go and do these things like you have to like book these things down to get so and my camera like this i think it should come up yeah i think it's better this way so what i want to do is i, I need to get to the front desk to the reception or the concierge rather so that i can book down all these things like today i want to go to the beach today and i also want to like tour the whole island because this is like a very very this is an island i mentioned this in my last video and the island is beautiful so like i want to tour it and i just want to see what the island i just want to see the way the island is then i also want to get to the beach today and do some other things but i need to book these things down as you can see i don't have any makeup on because i'm not ready to go out yet so someone is just coming to pick me Someone is coming to pick me now, then take me to the concierge area. Then I'll just book all these things that I need to do for today. So far, so good. I've been loving it here. It's so peaceful. Like, I don't even want to go back to anywhere. Like, it's so peaceful, but you gotta go back. <laughs> I wanna laugh out loud. Talk a little deeper. Kiss a little harder. about everything that was on our mind talking to you just got back from the front desk like the reception to plan my trip very well to book everything that i want to do before i leave this place and i have successfully done that i'm so happy um today i think today i just want to go down to the beach just chill there and tomorrow tomorrow i want to go to a neighboring island because this island is um praline island then tomorrow i want to go to ladig ladig is another island very close to this place but there is so much fun things to do in ladig like when they were telling me i was like okay i think i'm going to do that tomorrow like so so much fun things to do like um to go around the island you can either use a buggy or you can use bicycles or tricycles so i already booked for my own tricycle i paid for it already i booked that then i'll just go around the island and go to the beaches there um do there's so many things i said that i could do there i forgot and i would have a map they gave me a map because i really booked down for it by telling him i'll do that tomorrow but today today i just want to chill today at the hotel's beach because the hotel has a beach um I'm looking at it right now you guys can see it. yeah let's see I already had breakfast this morning so I'm pretty chill like I'm really really enjoying myself here I told the person handling my business I thought that I see don't message me in this period or don't call the only time you get to call or the only time you get to message me what I told her was if there's an emergency and what's my definition of an emergency if my name is inside instablog let's say instablog has called me out or somebody has called me out or something that's when you can call me but if it's not that nobody should message me like i just want to chill this period because sunday will come now i mean today's already friday oh yeah and i already booked my covid test because i'll do covid test this afternoon so that it will come out um because it takes 24 hours here they don't do like fast track thing at all so i want to go and dress up now get ready for the beach take few pictures take few pictures because i brought my tripod also take few pictures then change it to something beachy <laughs> after i've taken pictures you guys when i got this dress this dress that i'm currently putting on when I got when I saw when I first saw this dress, I was like, okay, fine, it's giving me like beachy vibes. Like my bikini is under the bikini that I'm gonna change or like wear there at the beach is under this dress like this. And this dress is extremely, extremely long. I got it from pretty little thin. But see, listen, I can't even walk. I can't even walk at all. Like I've been walking like this. This is how I've been walking. Like it is so tight, like I can't even lift up my leg 
so i um, change of plans i'm just going to use this and just take pictures then remove it then just um wear my bikini from the house to the beach what i wanted to do before was i wanted to wear this to the beach and take pictures there then remove it then you know change it to my bikini but with the way it's going i can't walk i'm not comfortable and it's making me sweat underneath which is very annoying and this place is very hot i haven't actually talked about the weather in this place at all um it's hot baby you don't know what you do to me between me and you i feel a chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced so go now I'm at the beach guys and I'm just waiting for my menu so that I can eat, relax, chill, read a book. I'm not reading any book, let me know that. Read <laughs> you guys look at my teeth. Can you guys see this? Can you guys see this? Like show me the gap. Show me the gap. <laughs> show me the gap. And guys, it's just six months, like six months. Six months and everything is just looking so good. Imagine how it will be like a year from now, because I think um, my treatment is for a year and a half. But in six months, the gap that I had in my front has closed. Can you see? It has closed. Then we are currently closing this lower one right now. But still, I'm happy. Okay. Thank just you. Just leave this with you take your time you guys see menu like exam paper like what does give us no way you guys i I'm seriously having mixed feelings right now about this ring. I had plans today. I told you guys of my plans yesterday. I have like good plans. The sea. You see that island there? Let me come here. Can you guys see that island? I'm supposed to be there today. That is where the fun happens in these seashells. Like you want to have fun, you go to that island. And I'm supposed to be there. And now I woke up and this is like 8. And see. And I'm supposed to be there by 12. I just hope and I pray that by 12 noon, this rain will stop. The sky would clear. The sun will come out and I'll still be able to make it there. So I'm, I'm like very pissed because of that. But I'm also extremely happy that it's raining because I haven't seen rain <laughs> in months. I haven't. I always sleep with sound of rain on YouTube, but so but this me seeing this right now is just I'm just so happy about it. Like I'm, I'm so happy, but then again I'm angry because it's spoiling our plans for this place. Guys, look at the sun. See my face. I was sleeping, though. I was sleeping, and I'm so happy I, I didn't miss my island whatsoever. I want to have my bath, then change, then go out. Look at the sun. I am so happy. You know, when I when I dropped the camera the first time, I had to call the front desk, and I was worried. I was like, hope this room won't spoil our plans. And they had to reassure me that nah, that the sun will come out. That this this is how it happens in such a it's just rain for like one hour then all of a sudden the sun is out again and that's exactly what just happened i know i'm owing you guys villa tour it just keeps keeping my mind worn and i i don't know why i don't want to it's stress it's stress to do apartment though i won't lie but i'm going to do it before i leave my flight is tomorrow night so i still have things to do tomorrow morning and tomorrow afternoon so in the morning by the time they finish cleaning like room service will come and clean it up then i will show you guys properly 
what this place looks like and you guys have just been seeing like bits and bits the pool and the bathroom you haven't really seen everywhere like that so i promise to give you guys like a proper tour uh but you're not gonna get it now because i want to go have my bath because 12 o'clock 12 o'clock i have a private boat coming to pick me up like a private boat coming to pick me up um by the beach to take me to the other island that i want to go to so i just want to get ready prepare for my boat then i'm going to have fun today like crazy fun today then tomorrow i'll show you guys what this place looks like sorry <laughs> fruit cocktail and the crystal kayak when you are on the beach you will see the crystal kayak you will see the souvenir and the beach when you finish sir relax on the beach then you have to come back the same way the same way you go the same way you back now when you coming back every every turn is on the left okay the same me you come back and you reach here we see people on the road you will see people on the road questions. you can ask any question it's a fair why did you tell people where's the sister please madam sir where's the sister they will tell you a famous a small island everybody knows everyone here we are 2500 people everybody knows wow. yeah okay okay any question just go straight straight yeah. then right down and right t-junction right yeah. t-junction always right okay. right okay Okay, so your girl packed her ride. I packed my ride here because I saw something really interesting. Let me show you guys. Look at this tortoise. Holy shit. Oh my god. It is huge. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. You guys, look at this. Yeah, stop eating. I think he's shy. He's not eating again. He's shy. <laughs> he was eating before when I started pointing the camera at him. He stopped eating. Oh, yeah, eating. I'm sorry. Oh my god, he's looking at me, guys. Whoa, this is crazy. Like, I was riding past, so then I saw it and I decided to stop. They are so beautiful. Look at this one. Look at this one, guys. Hello. Yes, there are plenty of like they are everywhere here like this. Everywhere. Hey guys, so I finally got to my destination. Ah, I'm so exhausted. After you guys, I went around this island with my bicycle. So finally I'm here. The person that's going to take me around, do the whole thing for me. Like he's going to um he's going to I'm going to give him my camera now. Then he's going to take over while I'm um inside the ocean the sea enjoy my life
and this thing is hooked to my boat and i'm so scared for my life right now it's hooked to my boat guys hey this guy said i will follow me i'm trusting his words and this is actually my phone i'm using to vlog this thing because if i should fall eh, my mother will come here and hold these people responsible for for my falling but look at these views ah damn Okay. This is the way of going to sleep. Feel it like this. Press in the front. Yeah. Do it again. Like this and press in the front. Yeah. Feel it again. Press in the front. So serious. You hold your coconut and you pull it. Yeah. Now let's Leo. Let's show them how fast you are. Now watch my champion go. Now Leo is actually born on a coconut farm. For Leo, this is normal. Poor guy woke up breaking coconut every day. Look at that guy. His turn. Like he's opening a banana. So that's what you call <laughs> a coconut master right there. Now, how to open the coconut without wasting the water. Now, follow me. Ooh. You don't have a knife. You just crack it on the rock. You break it into little pieces. And basically, that's how it opens, okay? But now, we make it easy for you. Instead of cracking on the rock, we're going to open it using a knife. Just remove the shell. Nice, nice and easy. And that's when you get out the beautiful shape of the nut. Now you eat the brown as well. Eat the brown because it's a nut. And that's gonna, why they call it coconut. You're not gonna wash it. No, why would you wash it? Well, there's it? no water when it's you're organic. stronger. It's organic, exactly. It's organic. It's organic, so I don't need to wash it. No, 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 you don't wash coconut. My teeth will never let me eat this one. Today is Sunday and it is my last day here but luckily for me my flight is not till night um 11 55 is my flight but I need to leave this island to go to the international airport with another airplane by 6 45 or by no by 8 10 but I'll leave the hotel by 6 45 then leave the island by 8 10 then use Emirates to go back to Dubai around 11.50 yeah so when you come in this way you are going to see my own villa I stayed in villa 296 you guys can see 296 is here staircase that leads downstairs like this so I'm just going downstairs leads downstairs to the gate of my villa so this is the entrance to my villa and i have like two 
key cards okay i have two key cards you just put it in like this take it out and you gotta really push yeah <laughs> okay that was a struggle you have to really push then i close it behind me and i lock it so if i actually want them to clean my room in the morning i just put this broom in front of my room and they clean it then if i don't want them to disturb me like let's say i just need my time alone i put this stuff this is a do not disturb sign i put it in front of the door and they don't disturb me so when you just look to your left this is like what i call this place now this is where you can relax actually you guys can see they put sofas here this is where you can relax there's a fan here for you and all you can also chew here have breakfast i had breakfast here um the second day that i was here i had breakfast here although it was very chilled but there was just so many flies and it was very uncomfortable so i had to go inside you can see practically another person's villa that's another person's villa down there look at this view that's another island there that is another island there that is another island there so moving here we have our sun bed over here then you could also go there and also enjoy the view there then to my right there's a swimming pool a private pool this pool i love this pool because it's isn't there's nothing like a deep side shallow side you know those things it's just leveled like the same one meter it's just level that's just the pool there the pool that is one meter so i love it like i've been uh, i don't want to leave this pool like having your own private pool is just the biggest flex ever so this is another key card so if i just put it so if i just put it here like this um i hope this one is not hard uh, uh, you guys I, this is how i struggle opening this door every time i don't know why it's always so difficult for me put it in then open it up thank you all right so coming inside we have the bedroom that's the first thing you see i'm so happy they've cleaned this room this room was a mess before you don't even want to see the way it was <laughs> So this is the bedroom you look at your right there's a tv here and there's like a small step here just come up and you jump on the bed nice <laughs> so you're waking up to your private pool and your views just you know living life and all from this bed on this side we have our mini bar this mini bar is stocked when i mean stocks like it is stocked like there's nothing they did not put here you guys can see i didn't open anyone because ah, it's not me they want to come and kill in this place you guys can see we have rum over here if i could do as if i wanted to do shots i would have done shots by myself red wine over here we have you want to put your eyes here cups wine glasses water and all of that then the is the fridge that is here the fridge is also packed guys i'll show you this fridge look also packed coming over to this side of the villa we have like the study the office here this is where i stayed to um edit the last vlog that i did it was here directly opposite to the study we have the closet here so my things are here as you can see i've really started packing my things because i'm about to jackpot so walking straight ahead we have the bathroom this is my favorite part of this villa i just love it a lot this is a bathtub as you guys can see this is a bathtub and just look at these guys like this is crazy they even gave me a pillow you guys see my small pillow so i could relax here like this and put my head here <laughs> and i could still enjoy the views like outside and all you guys look at one amazing thing it goes down so i don't want people to see me when i'm having my bath i could just do this and it goes down then the toilet is over here this is the toilet so apart from actually having a bathtub i also have a shower an indoor shower this is the indoor shower this is it then i also have an outdoor shower where i have my bath every morning guys i have not had my bath anywhere else but this place like i have never used this indoor shower is just here for fancy i've not used it since i got here i've been using the outdoor shower which is this love it so i just 
this is where i've been having my bath since i got here and that is the end of the tour we are done capish finished we have finished and that is the end so what i want to do now i want to try and book for a spa session i just pray that they're not fully booked because they could be fully booked if they are fully booked i'll just go to the pool and chill till my flight in the evening if they are not fully booked i'll just go and have my spa time me time get a massage get a facial and all of that and come back and pack so i hope you guys really enjoy this tour the video is not yet over so stick around guys okay my buggy just came i wanted to quickly talk but i am checking out i am checking out guys will you believe that everything that i got that is like inside these boxes i didn't even wear half of everything that i got it has been like an amazing trip for me and i'm so excited that i came here i'm going to miss you guys goodbye my neighbors Might go 